Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Friday, March 9th. This is for all signs. Please bear with me as I shuffle. I think it's uh, better to be authentic than save time. So there's a lot of emotions here. There's a lot of emotions here. There could be, you know, um, some sort of truth that comes out, okay, that um, pushes you in a different direction, okay? Yeah, there. I mean, there could be something that either pushes you or helps you to move forward in some way. It asks you to master your emotions, okay? You, it's your being, so it appears to me like there's some sort of dilemma, okay? There's some sort of dilemma that is probably, or has, it is or has, is hurting you, okay? It's hurting you. And it may be make you making you feel like you are lost or um, feeling alone or feeling like it's got you thinking. Put it that way. Something has happened that has put you in your head. Okay, has made you really think. What's my next step? What do I need to do? Because I feel like you're going through a period of recuperation, okay, from something. Or you will be. You may be feeling um, kind of down today. Maybe you just need to rest. Today could be a day of rest. It could be a day of healing, you know, healing your your inner self, all right? I It, it looks like maybe something could happen that is very, um, maybe it's even abrasive, okay? Something could happen that's abrasive or... Um, Brutally honest, okay, you know, something like that. There's a, there could be something that happens that you uh, take it as a little bit too harsh, okay? You may think of it as a little too bit too harsh, and it may make you feel emotional, but I feel as though, you know, you have the skills inside of you to to react with love and compassion, okay? So I feel like that whatever has happened that has made you feel almost... Um, Maybe like you feel like uh, empty, you know, I, an emptiness. I, you know, maybe you, this, this truth, this comes out, that comes out, it really opens your eyes and you may need to take a step back to, to really um, embrace this truth. You know, you may need to take a time out to, to absorb it. And the thing is, is I think that you handle it very well. I think that you handle it with grace and tact and, and compassion and love and so I think you it, but it might may set you off for a minute it might take you back you know it might take you back but it really helps you to move along in the right direction okay I think many of you have, know what this is you've been thinking about it um, I think that you know you're you're wanting to make a move and perhaps you've been stalling and now you're being given this raw opportunity to to accept this truth and move forward. 
Okay, and that's what's going on here. You've been thinking about moving forward, and I think today is pro you could get the opportunity to actually take those steps to move forward. All right, um, and it could happen very quickly. You know, it could. It could happen so quick that you know you don't even see it coming. All right, so it it just really looks to me like it could be um, there could be a little conflict, there could be a little trouble. And it could be a challenge, but I think you handle it with with tact and grace and compassion. And I feel like it's a really a uh, uh, time to be honest with yourself. Okay, just be honest with yourself in regards to this situation. Okay, I feel like you um, are headed towards success, even though during this moment it may not seem that way. It feels like you're heading in the right direction even though it may not be the way that you want it to, okay? But it had to happen because you were just sitting around thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it. And I have to remind you that these energies are fluid. This could have happened yesterday. This could happen a couple days ago. Could happen today or next week, you know. This is the energies I'm picking up on today. We're just going to get a few more cards. Somebody is moving forward after thinking about it okay after just sitting back and thinking about it they're moving forward taking action because maybe something happens that forces them to or opens their eyes there's some sort of awakening here a wake-up call okay where this truth comes out yeah there's some sort of leaving something behind Okay, and it could be it could be a commitment. It could be an old commitment. It could be um, there's something that at one time made you very content. Okay, it made you very content at one time. But look at these two are now, they're like mirroring each other, okay? So this is the Ten of Wands. This is letting go. Letting go of something. Because there's no more growth, okay? Here there's growth. Here there's no more growth, okay? This is the Four of Swords. It's like there's it, some there's emptiness. There's It's like the, I mean, in many decks, it's, it kind of, it's, there's like a coffin with a guy laying on it. So it's like a death of something. So it's the end. So, and I feel like there was a foundation at one time that made somebody very content. But now, the Eight of Cups, they're, they're, they've been thinking about walking away and heading in a different direction. And it appears to me that if you, your intuition has been really guiding you to do that, to, to just follow your intuition, accept the truth of the situation. Something is, is done. Something is dead, has reached a dead end. And now it's time to let it go with the Ten of Wands. It's time to drop it. It's time to let it go. It's too heavy to carry around. It's too much baggage. It's, it's, it's a burden. It's become a burden. Okay? It's time to let something go and accept the truth. And you may be given the opportunity to actually say goodbye to it. Okay? We're just going to get two more cards. <laughs> whatever this is it's been a challenge it's been a challenge you know you're into you've been fighting against your intuition your intuition has been telling you your intuition you've been fighting it it's like no 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 this this isn't true even though your intuition has been telling you that it is okay whatever this is i mean i think at one time it made you very content it made you very happy but it changed you know it, whatever happened something happened and it even could have been you know a lot of uh a lot of um i think abrasiveness you know with that page of swords that somebody who's very intense challenging um
take that one. There could be some observation going on as well, almost like somebody, maybe you've, you've been just considering, you've been watching this whole situation, you know, and whatever, and somebody's been watching you with that page of swords, there's some sort of observation and thinking about it, okay, somebody's been thinking about something, maybe just sitting back and watching, waiting for things to unravel. And their intuition has been telling them that they need to make a move and they need to do something about this. And today could be the day or, you know, days coming up that somebody actually decides to drop this burden that has been plaguing them. Oh my goodness. Dreams. Think big. There are unseen forces ready to support your dreams. It's a time of transformation, and you may not even know it, because the chariot is a transformation card. Things are evolving, and that's what's happened here. At one time, something made you, made you content, and you'd been thinking about leaving because your intuition was telling you to, but it brings so many trials and challenges, you know, and the thing is, is you're feeling empty and dead inside, not following your intuition. And now you're being given the opportunity to accept this truth and use your power to drop this burden and baggage that you are no longer content with. Blame. I accept responsibility for my well-being. Don't blame anybody. We all evolve. Follow your dreams. Take the step that your intuition is telling you to take. That's what I have for today. Talk to you later.